Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. This is Muhammad Azhar from Genius Soul. Today I'm going to show you another brilliant video that is how to correct or corrupted and invalid or null IMI numbers from Samsung device. Today I'm going to show you I9300 this one is S3 mobile you can find out here it is as there is uh, IME number it's starting from double zero therefore double nine one zero 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 blah 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 something in this case you cannot find out any network something over here you cannot find you cannot use SMS, calls, everything will be will not work. In this case, you have to check the USB debugging option. The first thing is you have to change your USB debugging. If there is no develop option, you have to tap seven times your build number and it will appear. Lower than this 4.3 version, you can find it over there, and also you can check my status in IND and my serial number, everything is corrupted. Here it is. Okay, now let's begin. My USB debugging option is turned on. <laughs> the develop show option you can find out here there is no anything but i am doing this is for only education purpose only most of the countries there is that is illegal the changing ime if you are doing any wrong or misuse i am not the responsible person you are the one okay let's begin first of all you have to uh, you have to root your device because see you can find out here super user is already installed and my mobile version i will show you you can find out here i9300 okay it means s3 the all of the samsung is the same method and the uh, next thing is USB debugging is on and the second thing is you have to type star hash 9090 hash the lots of people they are making some mistake because it's not working not connecting the complaints are I, uh, I heard but in here after the configuration menu you have to choose the speed option i mean the second one okay and the second one it should be 11 11 5 2 double zero it uh, must be the not the 11,900 it must be sorry there is something wrong uh, it must be not 921600 it must be 115200 the speed is must be 115200 okay now go back and open your Octo plus box. This is quick question. I am not using the box or without. Uh, this is using without box. You can find out here. There is no any options here. Okay. I will transfer my video into laptop. Please be patient. Okay. Here it is. I am. I have transferred this one into my laptop 
you can find this is not a box version this is the correct version which is which I am using please be patient See, you can find out here this is not a version which is I am not using the box okay you can find out here Yeah, it is. It's open. In this section, you have to choose I9300 because I already shown you in my mobile. That is the version. Now I am going to connect my USB cable. Okay, you heard the sound, which is my connected device. In here and press read info okay you can find out the reading info everything and my IME number you can look at here serial number and the IME number which I have shown before that one also appearing in the same section okay now I am gonna because I already took my uh, IME number and the serial number underneath the battery of my mobile and here it is copy and press repair IME and the serial number option I have pasted here and press IME affix okay Okay, done. It's the software is installing the doing their job, which, uh, which is the writing the IME number. You can find out here the phone IME is this one double zero four triple nine zero one zero six four zero 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 and also the phone serial number is everything is zero zero it's okay which is zero 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 is okay for in in this point you have to grant your super so super so option in your mobile tick and okay it okay i have done now you can find out here old ime number is which is showing here also showing here too okay i mean the old ime number which i have given the original ime number which is from the phone underneath the battery okay this is the ime number i have given over here okay you can find out here and be patient until the operation is successfully okay which is writing the ime number imei number you have to be patient the patient is the most important thing in my every video i am telling properly and clearly be patient if you want to do or do you want to be success please first choice is you have to follow the patient okay be patient this is the most important thing in this case i am going to i could forward this step two but some new guys i mean the new guys who are doing mobile repair and the software something they cannot understand what it is therefore they can also learn this thing which i am showing once you complete everything successfully your mobile will automatically restart okay your mobile will restart automatically
the operation progress is still running you can find out here in the operation progress bar Okay, it's updated and the version is IMEI number is successfully repaired. Okay, network is also successfully repaired. And now I'm gonna check and okay there is another problem my I am, now I am checking the read info phone is connected you can find out here the IMI number is changed which I have previously uh, mentioned that IMI is not listed here because this is the old IME number and this is the new IME I number but there is another one problem the serial number is zero okay it means we have to change our serial number to copy paste okay repairing okay once this process is updated I will transfer my video into mobile you can find out there okay repairing serial number it can take some time to this way phone will be phone will restart now serial number repair successfully okay in this point once the mobile is turned on I will read the info and you can find out everything the reading info Okay. Here it is. The IME number and the serial number. Okay, which I have mentioned and repair that is successfully done. And another thing is uh, the one uh, the octo plus correct version and the routing file of i9300 i mean which is i have tested that file also i have mentioned in the description link you can download whoever you need it uh, if you need you can download it there also okay guys now i will show you my I'll show you the IME number from my phone. Yeah, yeah. I have inserted my SIM card and you can find out. Yeah, here. Yeah. There is the signal bar also. You can hear I am using the hot SIM, the signal bar and the configuration message, everything are coming. It means the all the details are uploaded successfully here it is IMEI number which I have given previously in the software and I will show you in the settings also Here it is, the network is working and the IMEI number also you can find out the serial number. 
everything working fine okay and this point everything has been done properly please follow the video and if you like this video and enjoy please like and subscribe but i'm especially requesting from you every time end of my video please make dua only for me and my parents my family everyone